In this short video, I'm gonna show you how to scrape YouTube comments. Now I put up a Twitter video recently, that API has been deactivated. So here's another option to do sentiment analysis with data. So first we go to the Google Cloud platform. This is free, but you need to go into the Google Cloud platform, sign up, and then search for the YouTube API. I can just search for it here. I'm looking for YouTube API version three, can click into this one. And when we click in, what we have to do first is enable the API. And then we need to get an authentication key. So this is what's gonna authenticate us within the API itself. So you go up to create credentials here. So you've got two credentials, the API key and the OAuth 2.0. We're only interested in the API key because we're gonna pull this through Python. So I'm creating an API key. I can copy this and I stick this into my code to pull the data. So this is the boilerplate template for pulling comments from one video. I've got the code for this down below. I've got two flavors of this here. We're just pulling comments as text. And the second one is we're pulling it as a data frame. So I'm just pulling my developer key into the two of these. And now I need to go back to the video and find the video ID. So I can just copy this video ID straight from here, go back to my code, just paste the video ID in and play. And here are my comments here. So that's just the text, but if you want more information, you wanna do enhanced sentiment analysis, wanna see likes, all that sort of stuff, I can just copy this in here. And again, just copy this code, it will work for you. And we want to get more data out of this item. So I'm pulling the top level comment and I'm taking the author display name, publish that, update that, like count and text display out of this. And I'm gonna put this into a data frame. So this is a for loop where I'm gonna pull the information. I'm gonna put it into a data frame. I play that, I get the information. It's not nice. So I'll just show you this in the df.head and it will look a hell of a lot nicer when I press the play button. So there you go. An alternative to Twitter and Reddit, which have now been closed down. This is YouTube comment API. I'll do a further video on this later on, but this is just to get you started. Thanks for watching the video.